This is Hudson pear, a particularly nasty cactus introduced into Australia from Mexico some 60 years ago. It's become a major problem for agricultural enterprises. Originally it was noticed in the northwest of New South Wales. Subsequently it's been found in all the states of Australia other than Tasmania. It causes major problems for farmers with mustering, working dogs and is also a major problem for native fauna. Hudson pear reproduces vegetatively and it is unclear whether it produces viable seed. Like many other cactus species, Hudson pear spreads by movements of segments which root when they come in contact with the ground. Much of the spread of Hudson pear cladodes appears to be associated with livestock, native and feral animals, vehicles and water movement. New plants are capable of growing from segments of all sizes. Hudson pear poses several risks and threats to landholders, productivity, tourism and local ecosystems. To tackle the Hudson pear menace, landholders of local communities and industry groups are working in collaboration with local government, New South Wales government agencies to implement integrated control programs across northwest New South Wales. The key objectives of these programs are the establishment of containment lines and buffer zones around core infestations, the introduction of biological control agents within the core infestations and eradication of all plants outside these areas. However, biological control agents are not a silver bullet, but a very handy addition to the toolbox, particularly within core infestations, and should be used as part of a coordinated and integrated control program that might also include a combination of chemical, mechanical and cultural management tools. All landholders in New South Wales have a general biosecurity duty to prevent, minimise or eliminate a biosecurity risk, such as Hudson Pear, from their property. Specific focus on the property scale should be to maintain property boundaries, fence lines, roads, tracks and watering points. Working in collaboration with your neighbours and local community will help to ensure that the spread of this highly invasive cactus species is managed for the benefit of the whole community. Further information and advice on Hudson Pear management can be obtained through your local weeds officer, local land services and the Department of Primary Industries.